Conversation on matters of faith and joining us this morning is David Cagle with Downtown Church. Good morning to you, sir. Good morning. Thanks for having me. We are talking about the idea of church volunteers and the trend away from volunteerism. What can happen to a church that's struggling to find volunteers? Yeah, so I think what we can see, is going back to that 90-10 rule we talked about earlier, that if 10% of the church is doing all the serving for the church, mm -hmm. I think what we'll see in short is burnout. Because if 10% is doing all the work, then they're, they're not going to be able to sustain that pace. So how can you encourage other churches that may struggle in the volunteer arena? I would encourage two groups in any church that's struggling. I'd first encourage the leaders of that church. I'd remind them, look, you're not alone. There's a lot of churches going through the same thing. And to change the culture how you can in your church. And a lot of times when you're changing culture in a church, church leaders want to change it kind of like you're driving a jet ski, like a quick right. change of culture. But oftentimes it's more like turning a battleship and it mm -hmm. takes some time. I'd also encourage the members of that church to consider, am I serving Christ church? Because this is something the Lord wants for all of God's people. So how is the work of volunteerism an act of worship in and of itself? I think Peter answers this in the New Testament. He teaches the church and teaches Christians that when we serve with the strength that God provides, it results in Jesus getting the praise. And so he's basically saying Christians func uh, function as up arrows. And so when we serve in the church, we get to do that. We get to point people to Jesus as we're using that grace and strength that he offers. What was a volunteer task that really changed your mind on volunteerism or, or had you really getting into it? Yeah, so before I served on a local church staff, uh, I served in the kids ministry as a volunteer and it was a lot of fun, but those moments where kids had that light bulb moment and they understood what Jesus had done for them and they give their hearts and lives to Christ, it, it was just so sobering and such a special and fulfilling moment. And I think God wants all of God's people to experience moments like those. David Cagle with Downtown Church. We thank you for joining us for this edition of Faith Time. Coming up.